The Outsiders was written by S. E. Hinton, author of novels such as That Was Then, This Is Now, and Rumble Fish. The Outsiders was Hinton's first novel, and she began writing when she was only 15 years old. The book was a response to her friend getting jumped, and she even wrote a character after him. The Outsiders was published in 1967 and has earned a large fan base over the years as well as a lot of criticism. The book is written as an English essay, penned in the point of view of the main character, Pony Boy Curtis, a 14-year-old boy from Tulsa, Oklahoma. Pony Boy lives with his 20-year-old brother, Derry, who works on roofs, and his 16-year-old brother, Soda Pop, who has dropped out of school and works at a gas station. His parents, not long prior to the start of the novel, were killed in a car accident. The boys, as well as the group of friends that they hang out with, are part of a group called the Greasers, earning their name due to the grease that they use to slick their hair back. Although Pony Boy is a greaser, he enjoys riding, reading, and going to the movies, something that his counterparts do not share an affection for. At the beginning of the novel, Pony Boy is jumped by a group of socias, short for socials, the rival gang in town. The socias are basically the opposite of the greasers. They are very preppy, they have a lot of money, and they hate greasers. Because of this, the two groups clash often. Pony Boy is a bit shaken up after the incident, but he's able to walk away mostly unharmed. During this, we see the relationship Pony Boy has with his brothers. Soda is extremely loving and caring with Pony Boy and wants him to feel safe and included. Derry, on the other hand, is extremely critical of Pony Boy, and while it is obvious that they love each other, there is some contempt between the two. Pony Boy later explains that he feels Derry pushes him too hard, despite him being extremely smart. Since Derry is like a father to the boys, Pony Boy also feels sorry for his brother and wishes he didn't have to work as hard as he does. Later on, Pony Boy goes to the movies with two members of his friend group. Dally Winston, who moved into the neighborhood from New York where he was in a gang, and Johnny Cade, a shy, quiet boy who has been jumped and nearly killed by a group of socias. Dally begins to tease some soch girls at the theater, but Pony Boy and Johnny are kind to them. Pony Boy especially takes a liking to Cherry, a girl who listens to him and is kind. After telling her Johnny's story, Cherry tries to convince Pony Boy that not all socias are bad people who like to jump greasers. While walking the girls home, a Mustang full of socias, including Cherry's boyfriend, passes the group. The second time they pass, they make some threats, but nothing happens. Pony Boy goes home, and Derry is angry with him for staying out so late. The two get in an argument, and Derry slaps Pony Boy, causing him to run away. He goes to the lot and tells Johnny that he's running away, but they decide to walk to the park and back instead. When they arrive at the park, the Socias and the Mustang roll up and try to jump Johnny and Pony Boy. One tries to drown Pony Boy, but Johnny ends up killing him and leaving him on the ground. Scared and confused, the boys go to Dally for advice. He gives them money, a gun, and dry clothes, directs them to a train, and tells them to wait at an abandoned church until he can come later to pick them up. The boys get on the train and fall asleep. The next morning, they jump off the train and find the church. Johnny goes to buy supplies and the two wait in the church for five days. On the fifth day, Dally comes and gets them. He reveals that there has been a war between the Greasers and the Socias since the boys ran away, and that Cherry is serving as a spy for the Greasers. Eventually, Johnny decides to turn himself in and Dally begins to drive back to the police station. On the way back, they see that the church is on fire. Worried, the boys drive over to see what happened. It is revealed that there are children inside and Pony Boy and Johnny go in to save them, injuring both boys very seriously. They are all taken to the hospital and Johnny is hurt the worst out of everyone. Pony Boy is reconciled with his brothers and Derry apologizes. Later, a fight is scheduled between the Socias and the Greasers. The Greasers end up winning the fight, but Pony Boy is injured badly. Dally takes him to the hospital, but it is only to see Johnny, who dies shortly after Dally and Pony Boy arrive from complications with his injuries. Dally is so upset that he runs out and ends up getting shot by the police. At the end of the book, the Socias and the Greasers are still divided, but Pony Boy realizes that despite the differences between the groups, they're all just people and life isn't easy for anyone. 
This book is one of my favorite books ever. It is extremely captivating and well written, and the movie is a very accurate representation of the book. If you're looking for a short but amazing read, I definitely recommend giving The Outsiders a try.